Hi everybody, welcome back to my RPG Maker XP tutorial. This time around we're going to be looking at common events. So, in order to get to your common events, you click on database. The second to last tab is called common events. If you go there, you can make common events, which are used for events that are universal, that can be used on all of your maps. So let's say you want your character to run when a certain button is pressed. So our common event will name run. Our trigger will make a parallel process and we'll name our trigger to turn the common on running. Running. Okay. So when running is turned on, your common event run will be turned on. So if we go to set move route, go change speed for player, have him moving fast. Insert, we'll go conditional branch when button C is being pressed. C by default is your action button. So when C is being pressed, copy and delete that. It will change player speed to 4. When it's not, Set move root, change speed back to 3. 3 is your default. So when your action button is being pressed, it changes your speed to 4. When it's not being pressed, it changes your speed to 3. So that's your running event. So when you talk to Bob, control switch, running is turned on. You need a switch to turn your common event on. You can make it an uh, not an auto run but a parallel process that starts automatically at the beginning of your first scene which is wise. So I talked to him and now it's turned on. So you can see I'm moving at normal speed but when I press the action button he starts moving faster. When I'm not pressing it, he's moving slower. So that's what a common event is. I'll show you that it works on multiple maps. So, map 2. Let's fill this in. Let's make a new event here. That when you talk to this wolf looking thing. It'll transfer the player to map 2. Right there. Okay. So, I'll show you. Talk to him to turn it on. You can run. It's not a very fast run, but talk to the dog and it transfer you to map 2. So I press down the space bar which is my action button, and he moves faster. I let it go, and he moves at normal speed again. So, that's what common events will do. There are a lot more that there's a lot more that you can do with common events. You can make night and day uh, events. Yeah, there's a lot you can do with it. So. Thanks for watching my tutorial, and I hope you enjoyed it. I'll see you at my next one.